Any statement you'd like to make, Mr. Joseph, at all? We were there when Cowboys cornerback Kelvin Joseph left his attorney's office. Dallas police detectives questioned him for hours about his knowledge of a murder on March 18th. Joseph's name surfaced after this surveillance video was released by Dallas police showing a fight between two groups of men around 1.45 in the morning. It happened outside a club on Lower Greenville Avenue. Police say shortly after that fight, someone from one of the groups drove by in a black SUV and fired shots into the other group. 20-year-old Cameron Ray was shot in the head and died. Dallas police have been looking for those involved. Take a look at the video, take a look at faces, jewelry, clothing, anything that you might recognize. Then we're asking people to call Dallas police with, with any information they may have. Sources say after the videos were released, people recognized one of the men who was wearing a necklace with YKDV on it. That is Joseph's rapper nickname. His attorney, Barry Sorrells, confirmed to WFAA Joseph was in the vehicle that fired into the group killing Ray, but he says Joseph isn't the shooter. Sorrell said along with condolences to the Ray family, Kelvin apologizes to the Dallas community for being anywhere near this type of incident. Dallas police wouldn't confirm what Joseph's role is until they finished questioning him. Kelvin Joseph. Joseph was drafted by the Dallas Cowboys last year in the second round. He missed out on part of the season because he was injured, but played during the Thanksgiving game. He was on the field and got into a fight after he and a Raiders player taunted each other throughout the game. Both players were ejected. Joseph was cut by LSU after there was off the field problems. He was suspended in his final game. He issued a tweet after that suspension, apologizing to fans and saying tough times don't last forever tough people do. The Dallas Cowboys issued a statement saying they are aware of the tragic incident that occurred in Dallas on March 18th. First and foremost, our hearts go out to Mr. Ray's family and loved ones. The organization is aware of Kelvin Joseph's possible connection to this incident. The NFL says the matter is under investigation of the league's personal conduct policy. In Dallas, I'm Rebecca Lopez.